And as Ms. Carey is coming to the front, I'll, I'll ask Ma Miguel, Camille Ball, Eileen Posis, Thomas Quinn, and Lisa Aquila to please come to the front of the room. And before Ms. Carey begins, I want to recognize um, her long-standing commitment to the kids in Philadelphia and to education in Philadelphia. I don't know if everybody understands she served on the SRC and during some of its most challenging times. And um, we appreciate her service, her, her wonderful contribution to culture in Philadelphia. And congratulations on your new book. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Good evening. My name is Lorene Carey. I'm a writer. I teach writing at University of Pennsylvania, and I created an online publication called SafeKidsStories.com that came directly from my experience on the SRC. Vote That John is an outgrowth. It is a youth-led, enthusiastic, hard-working pop-up. It's a platform to amplify youth voice and increase youth participation in the 2018 midterm elections. Young folks planned events, a social media campaign, a website. They made videos, including an animated short that was so fun and so smart that the city commissioners linked to it on their website. I invite you to read and laugh with the blogs, enjoy the Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter feeds. So inspiring. Find the Vote That John song on YouTube and put it on blast. You will run out and register five new voters immediately. I promise. Registering to vote is extreme, urgent, ultimate, high stakes. It is grown-ass learning. Like learning to drive a car and date and make money. All kids want these things very much, like they want and deserve a say in who runs our government and writes laws and makes appointments. We've got teachers in our midst who are already registering 90 to 100 percent of the seniors in their classes. Fine curriculum and experience are right here, and great partners. The Committee of 70s Youth Outreach got students so hyped that several of them went out not only to vote, but to monitor the polls. I mean, score one for democracy. Other gold standard groups in schools now can definitely scale up. Inspire US, Rock the Vote, Just Act Theater, there are lots of them. The city commissioner's office wants to bring 17-year-olds into polls, even before they can vote as poll workers. Talk about project learning. Each generation is called on to improve, and sometimes, God help us, even to save the world. Our young people's challenges rival any in recent memory. The greatest generation who fought the Nazis, the civil rights generation, champions. Rivals them because our kids must rescue our planet and strengthen the systems by which we govern ourselves. Schools make room for what matters to us, from saluting the flag to the old weekly nickel bank deposits to Halloween parades. Voter registration in schools says that voting matters. It's like vaccination. It's like vaccination which can vaccinate our children against the apathy that sickens the body politic. Mm. It won't be hard, let's do it. 